Hi Triforce! So, starting next week is Sweat Mess, and I'm here with Coach Lori and her husband Ron, and we're going to talk over every all that he feels for it. So, essentially, Sweat Mess is going to look a little bit different this year. Uh, we are going to be competing gym against gym to finish a workout that Ron is going to be doing. More on that in a second. And the first gym to finish it, they are the winners. The gym that doesn't finish it first, they're the losers. And the cost of losing sweat mess as a gym will be that you will be doing 22 push-ups at the beginning of every class for the following week. The reason why 22 is because we are supporting Mission 22 for our charity this year, and 22 is the amount of veterans that commit suicide daily. So, Ron, a little bit about the Mission 22 and what you're doing. Sure, yeah, thank you. So Mission 22 is a charity out of Oregon, actually, that was built, and they dedicate all of their time to helping veterans and their families overcome the risk of veteran suicide. As mentioned, 22 veterans a day commit suicide, that's far too many. Um, so they help with all the things that cause, cause anxiety and it's just a great cause I try to give back and to support those families and help them overcome that. So with that being said, I designed a workout that I'm going to be doing starting on the 28th. I'll be working out for 44 hours, Mission 22, 22 times 2. Um, and the idea is to do a bunch of things all the, through the night and into the, into the light, symbolizing going through what it's like to go through darkness and into the light, depression and anxiety, things that I struggle with and many people struggle with. Um, so the idea is to find a way to push through, find a way to pick yourself up and just keep moving. So there's a bunch of pieces to it, but all of it's going to raising money for a good cause. So thankful to be a part of it with all of you. And we'll let Lori talk a little bit about what it looks like. All right, Triforce, here's what you guys are going to be doing this next week. This is one of the ways in which you can help. So next week, your coaches are going to lead you through several different movements that you'll need to be completed by the end of the week next week. Whichever gym completes it first, as Danielle said, will be the winning gym, and the other gym will be the losing gym, and you guys will be doing push-ups. But there are things on here that you can easily do during warm-ups or after class, things like running, biking, rowing, sit-ups, burpees, all types of things on here. As you complete things, let's go ahead and color off the little boxes that are on the poster, which will be hung in each gym, or tell your coach to scratch it off for you so that you can make sure to get credit for that. And just to clarify, this entire workout is what Ron will be doing uh, for his 44 hour workout. So what day are you doing that? I start on the 28th and I'll finish hopefully on the 30th. <laughs> Perfect. All right, awesome. And then also on here, there is a little QR code as well to donate to Mission 22 directly. All right. So there's a few different ways that you can support. Um, what the first way is to be doing the workout. So in class, hopefully your coach will be leading you through some, but also during open gym. If you see that there's something that you can do easily, knock it out and go ahead and get those points for your team. If you are a member of 210, if you are a member of World Golf, don't worry about it. <laughs> and then two is donating. So there's a QR code that is on the board. You can donate directly to Mission 22. Number three is social media. So a big part of this, um, of Sweat Mist, is we're trying to generate some hype and some, you know, be able to expose people to learning about Mission 22. So if you can video yourself or take a picture of yourself doing, you know, the workout movements or, you know, whatever it is that you can do, and go ahead and post that and share that on social media. That would really help to kind of get the word out about what um, the cause that we're doing it for. And I know that the goal is to raise twenty-two thousand dollars, right? Yeah, twenty-two grand. So, any help that you can do to help us get the awareness out, the better. Um, also, Ron is going to be sharing his journey, kind of what he's doing. So, we can share that too. Awesome. The more knowledge we can generate, the better. Um, then, number four and five kind of come together. So, on Saturday the 22nd, following the class at 210, or sorry, at World Golf Village, at 10.30 we are going to be doing a beer mile. So, 
it's going to be the typical beer mile that Triforce does, but with a little twist for charity. So Triforce will provide you beer, and you guys are encouraged to come on out and make a donation. And we will be doing a beer mile. We need to run some sheets. That would be great. So it's going to be a lot of fun, and hopefully raise some good funds for Mission 22. Then, following the beer mile, we're going to head over to Gators Dockside in Mirabella. So, if you can do all these things, wonderful. But at a minimum, come hang out at Gators Dockside and invite your friends or just tell your friends to go come on out and to support the cause. Because from 11 to 4 at the Mirabella Gators Dockside, they're going to be giving 10% of all the sales to Mission 22. So, we'll head on out over there after our beer run, but it's, you know, if you can, all you can do is just swing by and eat some lunch. Do that too. That's a great way to support. All right? Awesome. So, next week is Sweat Mess, and we're so excited for it, and I'm sure that we're going to raise a lot of money for Mission 